In this recording, I'm going to show you how to print a behavior referral from Infinite Campus. Uh, for the purposes of this video, I've logged into the Sandbox site indicated by this orange bar, uh, and my menus may be a little different than yours. I've chosen the proper year, so the current year and the school, in case you have access to more than one school. On the left-hand navigation bar, I'm going to go to the behavior area. Inside the behavior area, I'm going to click on the letter wizard. Uh, for the purposes of this uh, demonstration, I'm going to choose the student referral letter and I'm going to choose the date of the incident. So this could be several days later, but I'm going to choose the date of the incident, which was back on August 16th. Uh, there's ty different types of letters that you can print. Um, the default is this trifold send it in the mail letter. I'm going to print the, the full page version of that, so blank form letter. Uh, so just to review before I hit, hit print here, I, I selected the behavior letter wizard, I chose the type of letter, I picked the date of the incident, and I chose to use the full page letter. When I hit print, the system will generate the notifications. Uh, let me blow that up a little bit. Uh, I notice here that it's actually printed 12 pages, so I may have to print from page 3 to 3 or page uh, 5 to 5 if I if it was an, another incident on that day. The sections of the letter uh, include the student information, the school information, the description of the event as it was put into the system so that those event details, the location um, and the date, any investigation that the administrative team took, took part in, so additional details from that location, and then whatever resolution there was to the incident. On the bottom of the resolution letter is the, the standard um, text from our old letter system as well as room for a signature for the administrator and the parent.